Praise the Lord Jesus. When you have lack of faith, you have lack of provisions. Sometime, I was just meditating and the Lord began to speak to me. He said, ah, why are you no longer believing me for certain provisions? Now, provision is not only about food. Provision, maybe open doors and whatever. He said, you're no longer believing me the way you used to believe me about this. I said, Lord, the economy of Nigeria is showing me something different. I like to be honest with God. I, don't, I know many of you are faith men. You don't have this kind of weaknesses. So I told the Lord, and he said, am I not above it? I said, you are. And I don't pray the prayer the man prayed. He said, help my own belief. I said, help my own belief. He said, even when you are not seeing it, which you, and God will tell you the same thing you already know. Same thing you might be preaching to people. He will remind you. He said, even if you are not seeing it, since it's available in me, speak it. Don't cancel it. Since it's available in me, speak it. And then the Lord began to teach me something, which I'm going to teach you. I and the Lord are one spirit. If I speak a word, the words that I speak, they are spirit and they are life. And this word would not come back to me void. It must fulfill something. If it doesn't fulfill it for, my gener for me, it will fulfill it for my generation. But this word will not return back. And that is because he that giveth eternal life is inside of me. So since you miss Fanta and Coke together, you can't separate it. You can't separate me from him. And when I'm speaking, even though my flesh will be part of my speaking, but his spirit is also part of the speaking. So if my own flesh speaking falls, his own spirit speaking will, become, will come back fruitful. I don't know if you get what I'm saying here. 